Do you truly feel joy at work? Are you often discouraged in the workplace or do you notice others around you with low spirits? Our data shows 67% of the workforce is unhappy. A lot of people think joy and happiness are the same things, but biblically, the worldview requires you to separate these things. God does not call us to be happy when you're persecuted, but that does call you to be joyful. Check out the following TED Talk video in the description below and it explains some of the differences between joy and happiness. Happiness is an emotional state where you're influenced by external forces. Joy is something that comes from within. Happiness is something that happens to you. Coffee happens to you, ice cream happens to you. Coffee happens to me, but brings joy to my family when I consume it. Happiness is temporal. Happiness is not what we chase after. Joy is eternal. We have two solutions to give you. The first, identify the differences between the joy and the happiness in your own life. Second, choose joy. Make the right decision to have the joy in your workplace. An example of joy is a car battery in the engine. Charged by the fuel of Christ's love, you may be able to run the car without a battery, but if you ever stop, you won't be able to start the engine again without that joy or hope. To attain blessedness at the right hand of God in heaven, the blessedness which the Lord enjoys, the blessed that happens because of the Beatitudes is happiness and it results from actions. But joy happens from an inner wellspring provided by God. And remember, don't be discouraged. Joy is the eternal source of hope. No matter how dark the events of life can happen, hope is spurred on by joy. In our next video, Christine will share a story about the joy in her life as a working mother.